Rear Admiral Ajay D. Theophilus assumes command as Flag Officer commanding Goa Area Foga at INS Hansa Goa. Prior to assuming the position of Foga, Rear Admiral Ajay D. Theophilus served as a Deputy Commandment of the esteemed Indian Navy Academy, Ezimala. During his illustrious career spanning over three decades, he has made significant contributions to naval aviation and has a remarkable track record. Rear Admiral Theophilus, who joined the Indian Navy in 1987, was commissioned into the executive branch on 1st July 1991. His journey as a pilot began when he was selected for the pilot's course in June 1992, and he later joined the esteemed fighter stream of naval aviation. Having flown a wide range of aircraft, including Kiran, HPD-32, MIG-21, Sea Harrier, and MIG-29K, where Admiral Theophilus has displayed unmatched expertise in the field of aviation. Notably, he achieved a significant milestone by becoming the first Indian pilot to land MIG-29K on the aircraft carrier INS Vikram Aditya, with over 3,000 hours of flying experience, including 1,000 hours on Sea Harriers and 700 hours on MIG-29K, he stands as a seasoned aviator and a reverend instructor for Sea Harriers and MIG-29K aircrafts. Rear Admiral Theophilus was entrusted with leading the MIG-29K project. After completing the MIG-29K flying training in Russia, he successfully commissioned the squadron and played a pivotal role in trials and testing of the MIG-29Ks. Furthermore, he led the squadron in seamless integration with the aircraft carrier INS Vikram Aditya, showcasing his exceptional leadership capabilities. Commanding various naval units, including INS Trikant and the frigates INS Talwar and INS Tarkash, Rear Admiral Theophilus has exhibited outstanding leadership and strategic acumen. Upon taking charge as Foga, Rear Admiral Ajay D. Theophilus paid a heartfelt tribute to the brave personnel who made the supreme sacrifice in serving the nation. He placed a floral wreath on the war memorial at INS Komantakoa, honoring the memory of fallen heroes. Bureau Report, Herald TV.